Garcia, and I am an animal enthusiast here at the Tango Tango Market in Well, as you see, Tango Tango Market Zoo is a private rescue center for endangered and wild animals. So we are the conservation for these animals since 2005, and we are in coordination with the Department of Environment and Natural Resources, or the DEMR, and also the Department of Tourism and Animal Media. As our way to say thank you, we offer a lot of shows here this afternoon. First off, we had our Prado dancing. Now, we'll be your closer encounter with our talented animal ambassadors. And this is your Keeper Talk. And right after that, you will get your free photo encounter with our animal ambassadors, where you can actually hold them when you use it in the Ready to the pictures and that is all for free. Selfie Ruby Gilbala. And that will be your friendly animal encounter. But of course, Mama Mia, before we start our show this afternoon, I have some friendly reminders. Konting paalala lamang po. Una-una, please remain seated during the show. And second one, for those who are eating, may kumakain pa ba? I'm so sorry guys, and you finish it up. Opo, tapusin niyo po natin, or you can finish it later. Food is not allowed during the show. And last but not the least, for those who want to take photos and videos, pwede pwede po. But kindly disable the flash of your cameras because these animals are very sensitive and traffic light. This is for safety and for the safety of course of our animals. So, yun lamang po our most good is afternoon. Yan man, I have one question for you guys. Are you ready to meet our animal ambassadors? Yeah. Magtas ng energy. Nakapag-snacks po ba tayo na? Hindi pa. Oo, tapos bawa pang kumain, no? So, kung kaya na lang po. Okay, one more time. I said, are you ready? Yes! Okay, hindi daw sila. Ito na, let's meet our first animal ambassador. Who will it be? Oh, the entrance sa liga na rin. The colorful bird. One of the most colorful birds in the world. That's all we do. We have Barak. Barak, mga kapamilya, is a blue and gold cock. Blue and yellow cock. Scientific name, Ara Ararana. Did you know? The scientific name Ara, it means a genius. And researchers say that the intelligence of this bird is equivalent to a four-year-old kid. Katumbas ng apat na taong gulang na bata. Well, you see, mga mamiya, these macaws are parents in general. They have a list. We call them zygodactyl feet. Ibig sabihin, they have two toes facing forward and two toes facing backwards. Yan naman, they can actually grip objects easily, mga mamiya. And did you know, para here, Medyo matagal na po siyang nakatagal dito sa Filipinas. That's why we knew how to use this Filipino footwear. We call this Padang Padang. Let's do this, Barak. Ito na. Barak is gonna show you how to use it. Padang Padang. Then, look at that. Di ba? Dabang ng galing. And, siya, huwag pa naman po natin si Barak. Huwag pa naman natin si Barak. See? Ganyan po, very useful. Ang kanilang zygodactyl feet. Well, ikaw na sabi ko kanila, di ba? These birds have the intelligence rate of a four-year-old kid. Sito bang mga four-year-old kid dito? Oh, hi, baby boy. Opo, and of course nga pala, happy ka na yawa mo sa lahat na. Sana natin mong bisita. Thank you so much for visiting us here. And of course, ika nga, mga talino ay isang kapi. Good na to. Gano'n nga ba siya ka talino? Well, he is gonna do biosegregation. And from biosegregation, first you have to win. We have four biodegradable or no bubulong. And the other one is four non-biodegradable. Now, I have a question for you guys. Ginagawa po ba natin ito sa ating mga pangamahay? Or baka konti ng yes. How about, how about yung iba? Bakit natahimik? Silence means? Okay, sige, I'll take it as a yes. Well, ito, ganun na simulang kuya. Ito na, what we're gonna do? Biosegregation. Ito na, lalim nga baka talino. Ang isang blue and gold macaw. First one, that's a plastic. Siyempre, hindi na bubo. Ito na, pangalawa, yan ay, huwag namimili, o may plastic daw muna, yan ay, yan, buy your brain from Harry, two more. You see the two more, and that's one, that's a dry leaf, magulok, and last one, isa na lang, isa na lang. Siyempre, another leaf, that's four, buy your brain, wala ba, ano mo na, kasi 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 na, Blue and Gold Macau is actually the second largest species of Macau's. Naalala niyo ba yung movie na Rio? Sino yung bigger doon? Ang pangalan? Blue! 
Blue and Rio is the highest in the Macaw. Yun po yung klaseng Macaw, yung pinaka-largest uh, species of Macaws. This one is the second largest and they are endemic in South America, particularly in the Amazon in Brazil. And now, let's give it up for uh, our Blue and Rio Macaw. Thank you guys. Bye guys. Thank you. Give up. One of the most colorful birds. Now, I'm a colorful girl. Speaking of colorful, about this next animal class, or in fact, it is one of the most distinctive birds all over the world. The last of it, we have Apollo. What is Apollo? Oh, it's pure and 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 Apollo Camila is an umbrella crested cockatoo, scientific name, Kakatua Alba. Kaka is an Indonesian term for a brother, and Tua means older. So, Kakatua means older brother. Oh, di ba yung Kakatua? Salamat po, tumawa ko yun. Hindi ko alam kung saan yung Kakatua. Doon sa joke yung sawalin. Sawalin, okay, I'll take that. Okay, but of course, mga kamila, this bird is actually Ito si Apollo, napaka-expressive na po yung mga bird dahil ipapapinin sa atin kung ano nga ba kanyang nararamdaman. So, are you feeling boy? Okay, what are you feeling now? Tell us how, ipapapinin niyo siya. And then, ito na ako, look at that. Napapatalon, eh. He is slowly opening his plants. Okay, so this is sa ilalim ng mga nagpagkain ba niya. Okay. And, look at that. Don't you see mga mga, just like the dog's cast. These birds also show their affection or yung kanilang nararamdaman by what they are doing. But especially now, these are very impressive cockatoos. They are opening their crest if they feel happy or excited. Excited ko ba kayo? Okay, and of course, Mokila, these animals also have their defense mechanism. Ipapakita niya po sa inyo kung ano yung ginagawa nila para maprotect ang hanap ng sarili, especially back in the wild. Okay, ako ngalo? Let's say there's a raptor coming. May kalakan, anong gagawin? Play dead, hindi naman po ako ang mabawa niya. Gusto yung mag-isa? Okay, hindi rin mag-isa. Isa pa nga, there's another raptor coming. May kalaban mo na, ang dami ay... Okay, pero kung mag-isa ako. See, even these birds, they are doing everything. Pinagawa rin ang lahat para mag-survive lang ang back ng hawa. And now, there we have it. Bawa ko na tayo. Bawa ko tayo. Thank you guys. Bawa ko tayo. Thank you guys. Thank you guys. Apollo or Brown Plus and Cockatoo. At ang kanyang nga pangasikat na anong fair, may kamukha ko siya. Parang si Manny. Manny Pacquias. Pacquias. Muntik na magkakumakay. Okay, now, moving on to this next animal ambassador. Uy, eto. This next animal ambassador ay proudly Pinoy. Ibig sabihin dito lamang sa Pilipinas na nakikita. Ano nga ba ito? Eto. He's only wondering. We have a... Philippine Great Warrior Pass. Can you have a shot? And he's right there. And the map of Pasa is a Philippine Great Warrior. Come on, everybody. Huwag ka nang mahiya. Ano yung kinakaw? First time niya kasi ulit. Ang dami ko ang kakaw. Come on, boy. Okay. Oh, medyo nahihiya. Wait, palapang po natin. Okay. Wow. You want to go here. Hi, everybody. Mr. Bill is a Philippine Great Warrior. Scientific name, Boceros Mildenensis Mildenensis. Mean, you know, mean tenensis is from the two words of meaning. Mean da means mean the now. And ensis means belonging to. So these words belong to mean the now. And in mean the now alone, locally, ang tawag natin sa kanila ay kalaw. Alam nyo ba? Yes, kalaw. That is the local term for this very well. They are the most, uh, one of the most beautiful birds, I will say, because they have long eyelashes. Napakahala po ng kanila ay kulit mata. Have you been to our ostrich ranch? Natural po yan para sa ating mga Philippine Great Warriors and they also have blue eyes. Yes, napakaganda yan. Well, of course, mga Pilipina, we call them warriors because of the horn-like structure na sa ilalaw ng kanyang tukang. And these are actually medium-sized bears. Now, these animals are eating fruits. What do we call animals eating fruits? Anong tawag natin? Oh, wala? Okay. Eto, secure question muna. What do we call animals eating meat? Kapag gumukay ang karne, tawag natin ay carnivores. How about animals eating herbs, grasses, plants? Herbivores. How about animals both eating plants and meat? Omnivores. Very good. Just like as humans, we are omnivores. Now this one. How about animals eating fruits? 
20, well, approximately there are 60, 60 species of owls all over the world. But ang aking Philippine Scouts owl is actually the smallest. Three na kamalit eh. Okay? Ikaw ba, ilang owl na kamalit ako sa mong buhay mo? Marami na? Hindi po yun sa libro. Ay, ay, hindi na talaga sa mong sunat. Okay, how about you ma? Ah, okay, okay, marami na. Marami na talaga matama. They have a super power hearing. Dahil yung kanilang mga prayer at natago sa ilalim ng snow at even sa ilalim ng halaman, maridig po yan ang ating mga, mga owls in general. Ayan din po siya ang powerful. Okay? Well, so what for that? Moving on to this next animal ambassador. Ayan po, ipapakilala natin. Proudly pinoy lahat. And this next animal ambassador is still commonly found here in the Philippines and particularly sa Palawan. So tingin nyo, anong animal ito? Yes, it's a Palawan bear. And look to your left, I think, joining us this afternoon is a bear cat, a Palawan bear cat. Tell boy, scientific name or Tiktis Vinturo, commonly called as Vinturo. Well, they are three animals in one. Look at the face, looks like a cat, and their body shapes like a bear, and their tail is prehensile, just like monkeys. But of course, we know that we are in Kaliwa. We are going to talk about why they have a prehensile tail like a monkey. Because Teddy Boy is going to show you kung gano po ang napakalaking tulog ang kanilang mga lutod. And at a half and 3, 2, 1, look at that. See, that tail actually serves as a fifth pin. Pang limang paa na po na lahat ng mga panawang herkes. Napakalaking tulog po yan, especially when they climb up or down the trees. At hindi nyo nyo, alam nyo ba kahit ang pagbuwa sila sa puno, nakauna po yung ulo. Yes, hindi po natin ang panawang herkes. At bakit nga po bear ka? Let's uh, show them what you got. Look at that. Bear shaped like poo. Yes, we have we call them three animals in one. Now this year I'm about these little ones because they are also food to animals. They are mainly eating fruits, nuts, seeds. At alam niyo po ba, ang paborito ng brutas ay rambutan. Yes, so these palawan bear cats, nakakaubos po sila hanggang tatlong kilong rambutan. Isang upuan na. Yes, ganyan po sila kapit mga wabuyan. Okay lang, okay lang siya. Okay lang po yan. Okay, okay. Okay na po po natin si Teddy Boy at si Kuno ang ating Palawan Bear Cats. So thank you so much guys. Well, these Palawan Bear Cats are actually territorial. Nakapunta na po ba kayo doon sa exhibit natin ating Palawan Bear Cats? May naaamay ba kayo? That is actually their natural scent. They are living their scent. Pinigiwan po nila ang kanilang apoy, amoy para mamarkahan nila ang kanilang teritoryo. And that scent actually smells like buttered popcorn. Yes, that is their natural scent. Okay? Proudly Filipinas, totally found in Palawa. Diba? Ang dami po na natin animals here in both Philippines. Well, okay po ba kayo? Okay ba? Do you want more? Do you want more? Yes! We will give more. Please, next. Please, next animal ambassador. Okay, no? Ang pinakasikat at pinipilian ng mga chicks. Sikat daw ito eh. Parang kasikat na puso si Piolo Pascual. Mga ganong level. Now, this next animal ambassador ay ilalabas na natin. Okay? Well, ito po siya. Yeah. 
Of course, everybody will get a chance to be able to get a little to take your free for a thousand with our animal customers. And we have our trainers, who are Dexter, who are Jimar, and who are Michael, who are now a lot of work with Zoom, working with nature for a better future. Yes, so that's what I'm going to do. Good morning, good morning. Thank you so much, guys. Happy Kadaya to all of us. Thank you. Picture it now, yeah? Oh, what? So, sino po? Sino po? Gusto naman ang picture sa ating Juno. So, po tayo. But, please, social distancing pa rin po tayo. Don't worry, guys, because everyone will get a chance to have your free photo encounter with our animal customers.